Hello everyone, welcome back to Fire Emblem 4, Genealogy of the Holy War. Possibly the final episode. I don't know at the time of recording, because I don't know how long it's going to take us to beat this. But <laughs> in theory, this is very short, but it could also be, be very long. I've had some very wildly different experiences with the last portion of the final chapter. How about you, Rin? How are you doing? Good, how are you? I'm uh, doing alright. A little scared, because as we started recording, my computer was like, Nope, I'm rebooting. Bye! <laughs> Just twice, out of nowhere. I don't know why, but it did. And now I'm like, scared, looking at my temperatures and everything to make sure it doesn't die. But it looks like we're fine right now. Seize the castle. I got everyone in position uh, near the next castle, so we don't have to walk all the way here with anyone but Selif. And uh, we'll get some company, sure enough. Soon enough. I am... Um... So it's, it's kind of... It's very cold where I live in terms of what we normally go through where I live. Mm -hmm. um, I, I normally I normally live in a very hot and humid place, so like nobody's really prepared for anything like that to happen. Well, yesterday I had to go to work, <laughs> and when I went to go start my car in the morning, it was oh, no. frosted over. I had to let it defrost. Um, it just wouldn't start. Um, I was oh, told God. that sometimes when a uh, when it gets really cold, uh, your battery can just stop working in your car. Which was something I did not know could happen. Oh no. So then I was like, okay, I can't, like, I, my car's just not starting, I need to get to work. I got my, uh, my roommate to take me. <laughs> and remind you that the reason why my car stopped working was because it was too cold. On the way there, his car starts smoking. <laughs> like, and oh. his car starts overheating. <laughs> I, I I just like we pulled over and I was like I'm not coming in today I'm calling it quits. <laughs> Sometimes life just says no you don't get to work today actually. That's uh that's valid. How do you like this part of the chapter? And do you enjoy barons with thirty percent chance to negate your attacks? Is that something <laughs> you enjoy? It, this chapter this part of the chapter is just so long. It's the end. <sighs> oh they have so much like... <laughs> They have so much <laughs> They're coming here. <laughs> They're gonna float me. All right, go care for <laughs> It kind of sucks that genealogy just during the second half of the game just feels so rushed because it the maps to me look very similar in terms of it's just a wall of enemies over and over and over again. Mm -hmm. Whereas, like at least in the first part of genealogy, you have to think a lot more. Um, I, I like at least in my opinion, especially during like chapter two. Especially with you this just setup. Have to, yeah. Oh yeah, well yeah, with this setup, oh my gosh. Chapter one and prologue took forever <laughs> to figure out. Yeah, no, absolutely. I think this might be the second worst wall in the game behind <laughs> the wall of Eta, but it, it's up there for sure. Uh, I kind of blocked away from my own charm bot. I don't know whether they'll attack Kerpre because if they don't see enough hit on him, they'll just ignore him and walk by. Oh right, we have this. Here we go. Oh, yeah. Oh, uh, yeah. Is th oh, this is not the weird-ass one with Ares and Nana. This is a reasonably normal one, right? Do you want to do Nana? <laughs> sure. Say, Lord Leaf, how soon do you think this fight will be over? I cannot say for sure. I told him to was the finale, but I'm actually not sure. Yet I cannot help <laughs> but feel our triumph is drawing ever closer. Well, hopefully it'll be done in uh, 40 minutes. <laughs> Otherwise, we might have to go on until next week. <laughs> and once this is over, I take it we'll be headed to, uh, to Leonstar? Indeed we are. The Thracian Peninsula has known naught but strife for decades, and to unify it was my father's dream. I'll pledge my life to fulfill this grand vision, and I'd love nothing more than to have you by my side every step of the way, Nana. Of course, Lord Leaf, I'll be by your side forevermore, wherever your path leads, even to the very ends of the earth. Cute! They're so cute! Wholesome. And she gets plus two defense, for yes. whatever reason. She, I mean, she needs that. It's gonna let her... Yep. It's gonna What's let, it it's gonna gonna let her. It's gonna let her. <laughs> to be done. I think this is safe, right? Yeah, like four up is safe. Okay, let's see if we can get some hit and runs in with these two. Ugh. It's better be safe. Please be safe. Oh, you're not safe. Ah, fuck. How heavy is this? 12. You have 12. You're totally dead, aren't you? Ugh. You don't have pursuit, right? I do. Ah! <laughs> Cringe. Alright. We'll dodge something. Let me see what they do, what these barons do. Last one to move is definitely Hilda. Maybe they'll clog the space up with other barons. And then she can't get there. I don't know. 
Oh my god, you have so much move! You have so little magic, though. <laughs> you have to do, like, no damage. <laughs> it's okay, the rest can't reach these people. I I don't think they can clog it all the way, because Hilda can move on uh, mountains and the other guys cannot. But they, they sure seem to, like, want to go for Altena. They just can't make it. They see her, they're like, I want her. They see her on the mountain. That's fair, Altena is very cool. I mean, yeah. It's hard to say that anybody not writing a like a wyvern is co not cool though, mm -hmm. you know? Yeah, I think even the, I feel like even the writers are always cool looking, I feel like. <laughs> I, I I feel like just writing a wyvern gives you like a plus ten to your cool stat. Uh-huh. Well hopefully we get a plus ten dodge stat here, because she has a hundred hit right now. Hmm. Don't nuke me, please. Glitch. No, my computer will overheat. <laughs> Don't do it. No. <laughs> Alright, bye. <laughs> I'm not watching Altena die. I can't, right, do it. I can't do it. I can't do it. I can't watch Altena die. All right, we have another convo. <laughs> I just found <laughs> midway through moving. Everything all right, Joe Javier? I gotta admit, even I am having a hard time keeping up. But hey, Dozel's on our hands now, right? Gotta keep going, just a little longer. Don't do anything too dumb, okay? Dozel still needs you around to rebuild. Yep, you got it. I can't just die now and leave behind my father and brother's messes now, can I? I'll be needing your help too, Larcy. Sure. You've helped me an awful lot, you know. I ought to return the favor. Whoa, thanks. I love you so much, Larcy. What? Do you help me here? What do I say about doing dumb things? They're like actually married. <laughs> Three strength? Yo. That's pretty good. That's good. It's still gonna let them kill anything, but it, it, it looks good on a stat screen at least. Take that. Gosh, these units. Uh, they reminded me, uh, they said something about rebuilding Dozer. I need to make sure that we don't have to actually rebuild it. Uh, Arthur, get away from there. Because <laughs> there's going to be a bunch of wyverns coming out there, probably. And I'm not gonna sure you're going to like it. Okay, uh, Favel and uh, Hannibal. We'll probably have company down south somewhere. And I feel like one of these two can handle that. But first... Barren moment. Oh, yeah, you think that's the easy target. Okay. <laughs> Understandable. It is not. I feel like his tail is, like, spread throughout the land. You know what I mean? His tail? Like the the trail, the trail wind? Or, like, wherever he's gone? Mm-hmm. Ooh, ooh, ooh. Do it again. Get him. I feel like he would have zero hit, even if he weren't on a mountain. But we're on a mountain, so I know what he's thinking. I, it's so weird how the AI... Decides whether it wants to deal with zero hit or not. I know leadership is something they tend to ignore, but leadership is nowhere near. In fact, I probably forgot to move Seleth. That's how not near it is. <laughs> okay, well, you. Oh. Oh, well, uh, yeah, a, go <laughs> Ulster! <laughs> yeah. Kill him! Yes. It's too easy, dude. <laughs> Next. <laughs> I won't let you guys sit through another one of those, don't worry. <laughs> Okay, I'll start. Kill him. Fast. Speed. Okay, oh. they're blocked. Okay, yeah, okay, so they don't want to force it to him, but they do, or they don't want to, what's it called? Use the, the tome, Thoron, but they do want to use mm -hmm. Sliver Lance. 55, 9, that should be killing twice over. Kill him, Carepree. Get it. Yeah. Boom, easy money. This has to be the only fast way to kill them all. It's either this or you just like dance past. Because they're not even blocking the castle. If you have enough movement, you can just get by them with a dance and a rescue <laughs> and just ignore them completely. Just like the Wall of Edda. It's like, imagine trying to protect your castle, but you'll just leave like one part of it completely open. Like there's like, a massive hole in the wall that an entire battalion can fit through. Look at their armor though, dude. <laughs> like, do you think they can look left or right? Oh, what? <laughs> That's a good point. You're not going to see anything coming in that. It's like massive shoulder pads in the way. In the, in the way. Yeah, no, they, they can look. They can't even look behind them, dude. They can look forward. <laughs> so I can understand they might have a little <laughs> holes in their defense here. <laughs> Imagine being able to like turn your neck like 180 degrees <laughs> just so you can see <laughs> freaking deploying owls in this army right here. Okay, you can take another hit. He'll be okay. It's not like there's like 50 more of these. I guess Hilda has weapon triangle with Vanjo over him, but Hilda also hits on the res, which been told Kirpre has plenty of res to take another hit, right? Please don't be another copium moments. 
<laughs> oh. See, this is why I want a charm nearby, but then I remember my charm bot had six. Whoa, what? Oh my gosh. Well, this is why I said it might not be the final episode, because shit like this might take up some time. Next, do you know how many kills Forsethi had before this? Eight. I had eight kills with Forsethi. <laughs> I did not use it that much. If you did, you would have 100% crits. Oof. Or something. And you'd be fine. God, that makes me nervous. Yeah, I know, right? so close to dying. Yeah. They always wait until the last possible moments just to move their shoulder pad one degree to the right. Uh, I know the last couple only have fortifying silverlands. Not gonna help me here though. I don't think Hilda can reach from there. You're too far away, Hilda. You're not gonna make it. Right? Please say it. Please say it ain't so. <laughs> oh my god. Stop the heal. Stop the heal. Dude. How do you possibly have damage to heal? You healed two times already. Hilda? <laughs> okay. Okay. All right. Cure Brace, fine. Oh, God. The boys are here. The Bow Knight Squad. Oh, my with God. Your it's going to take them forever. Your favorite portrait in the game. Dude, he looks so... <laughs> like, how do you have a bowl haircut, a mullet, and, like, a regular haircut all in <laughs> one? With, like, the locks to decide as well. Yeah, like, he's so ugly. <laughs> yeah, give me OVO any day. Alright, guys. I know I know what you're doing. I... <laughs> do they? They don't look like they do. <laughs> oh my god, it's gonna take them forever. It's okay, we'll we'll get to them. We'll up-move them by a little bit. Alright, our turn. So how much attack do you guys have? 31. That means to do 6 to Hannibal each. So Hannibal dies in 11 hits. I think there is at least 11 of these bow knights, and he doesn't have a great chance to buff these. And then this bosso guy over here, with pursuit and a cost and 40 attack on this Kirabo, I don't know if Hannibal is the person for the job. Let's see what Faval looks like. He has 22 defense. He has like almost as much as Hannibal, but 14 more HP. And his avoid stat exists. He has 73 avoid, so they only have. What's it like? 35 hit on him? Mm -hmm. So we can be in a forest to make that like. 15, which we all know 15 never hits. 14 does. It hit Kirpray like 50 times over last turn, but 14 or 15 will never hit. Well, I guess it's up to Faval to do this. How much hit do you have? You have a bazillion. But they have like no overlapping ranges because, like you said, they're taking forever. So maybe we can be a little cheesy. Maybe we could put him like in that forest. And then I think a lot of them can reach that. Oh, not that many. Can we get closer? Maybe I'm not the forest? That'd be kind of awful. Maybe this forest? <laughs> I'm gonna find I wanna be on a forest. I feel like it would be safer to be on one. Although we outmoved them, so maybe it's we don't have to be super particular about this. You should, let's see. Yeah. Alright, let's the ball on a forest and then um Hannibal. I can't Hannibal on the church. Uh Ew. Well, the problem with the church is it's only useful if you survive a turn. <laughs> and if you don't survive a turn, you don't have to. He'll survive a turn? What do you mean? Come I mean, on. he's going to survive a turn right now in the church because no one gets to attack him, right? I guess we can spread Faval and, and Hannibal out a little bit. Uh, both have him take out a couple enemies. Yeah, if you put Faval in range of some of them, he'll kill them and they won't be able to kill him. He won't. They just won't have enough hit. Mm -hmm. And then put Hannibal on the church and then the remainder will go for Hannibal. Well, no one's going to go for Hannibal when he's on the church right now because they can't reach him, right? Or you mean like well, next yeah, turn? yeah, but okay, okay. next turn. Yes, okay. Well, I have my Brave Bow. Does he even kill with the Brave Bow? He has 39 attack. Hannibal doesn't even kill. <laughs> That's so sad, Hannibal. Come on. Uh, let's let's go get some uh, get some money. <laughs> <laughs> let's get some money. Yeah. <laughs> all right, he has the whole the whole poem for all the all the the guys, all the the holy crusaders. For yeah, I'd be like, especially if I was somebody who didn't have holy blood, I'd be like, dude, shut up. I do not care. <laughs> Well, I mean, half he doesn't care about half of the meter. He only said like four or five of them. Yeah, see, dude, how lame. Not bad, ain't it? Very cool, dude. Very cool. Yeah, wow. I've had customers come into work and be like, "Do you want to hear my poem I made?" <laughs> I'm like, I'm, I'm like, I really don't, but I have, I have to say yes. <laughs> oh no. Uh, I'm not really into poetry, but it's not that I think 
like poetry's bad or anything. I just don't really have the artistic uh, means to appreciate a poem for what it is. There's mm -hmm. this one YouTuber that I won't name that I really like, but they do poetry at the end of the video sometimes. And it's like, it just doesn't click with me, but I feel like that's more my fault than theirs, if you know what I mean. Like, I just don't <laughs> get it. <laughs> I, I th uh, Yes, I, I think it's just... Like, that was the first time I ever met that particular customer that came into the shop. Oh god, it makes it even weirder. Yeah, it's just, like, it feels a little cringy, unfortunately. A little bit. You have Night Ring? Yes, okay. Can you do this? No, absolutely. Okay, let's try this, and then Canto back, maybe? I don't have a whole lot of reach with uh, our Dancer. Uh, Ulster, you're gonna be, like, killing this today, or, like, is this it? Are we, are we done now? Oh, okay, good. <laughs> nice. <laughs> Nice, nice work. Good work, bro. Uh, go back here. Cause I think I can get someone else to like stand here and then do like this or something. This seems like a good move. Maybe we can still choke the points. Or maybe we have to fortify here. Uh, do we have another good heal here? No. Tinny. I guess I can bring Tinny. I don't know what she's gonna do besides kill Hilda, of course. That's that's just, that's a given. Is this? If we attack him at one range, no, they won't use. Nah, they won't use the silver lance, right? Right. I thought you just did that with Ulster, and he used. They used the Thoron. Yeah, uh, they also have Thoron equipped, so I think they only use silver lance on their phase. Like they just never use silver lance on my phase. It's, it's outrageous. It's unfair. Can you have a silver lance and not use it? Um, Ares is the last person I want to check. Okay, he's not going to make it. That's just Lana here, and. Okay, I guess we can rescue Ares up here. He seems pretty good to have. In fact... You guys can only, like, move through... You can't go through this mountain, right? Yeah, you have to go through here. So we took this point. Everyone behind here is safe. So let's just get Ares up here. And have him do something. <laughs> yeah, yeah go Ares! Ares doing something is one of my favorite things in this game. Uh, okay, I know it's, I know it's just a square where I want him. Let's go here. Ares, come here. Please tell me I can reach. Oh fuck. Okay. How about <laughs> how about here? Ares 2.0. Okay, come here. Again, I don't remember the default tile, so I have to guess here. Perfect. That's what I wanted. I don't know if he's gonna reach, but let's try for a kill. Let's try. Crit. No. Oh, oh, no. Come on. Yes! Yes! Boom! Oh, never mind. He doesn't reach. Oh, well. Uh, go here and heal this guy, I guess. Go here. Dance. Heal my Cure Prey. Give him some charm. Because Hilda's going to give a bazillion leadership, and I can't have that. I don't know how to make sure that I see Hilda's animation, but not all the barons. So I guess we'll just have to speed up a little bit. Look, Nana got more strength. She's yeah. gonna be so strong. She's gonna promote and get like five strength too. She's that amazing. Huh, I wonder if Hilda's killable this turn if we get all these kills here. Like maybe Shannon on Mountain? And then Ulster kills the guy behind them, and then and then we're cooking. Uh Shannon? Don't like that, Shannon. <laughs> okay, good. Thank you for your money, Mr. Baron. This will fund all the repairs. Okay, so now we can new kill that. Uh, this is kind of not the tile I wanted to be on, but here we are. It's fine. We're only facing like 13 hit, so you'll be fine. Uh, 25. We need an adept. You'll get it, right? Mm. You can crit too. Mm. He'll, he can, or, or Altena can finish. Possibly. Let's get it. I won't fall anywhere near as easily as those other worms. Ah, no, you don't have great shield though. <laughs> yeah, I was about to say. We're, you don't have a chance for us to just not hit you. Goodbye. Boom. Sorry, Tinny, but <laughs> this is really going to be very painful if I was going to use you for this. All right, excellent. No more leadership here. So now we have no other means of supporting Kyrie, but he should be okay. Let's see if we can do something. 
Our res is kind of bad, right? Yeah, 16. Should probably do some damage, at least. Shield sword? 12 damage a piece? Sign me up! Set for the gay bulge. Dun, 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 dun. Depths? Yeah! Yo, my, my, you said, yeah. <laughs> my Paragon unit didn't level cap in final chapter. One, two, three, four. Ugh. Okay, you, you double these at least, right? Like you don't get wrecked if you just fill here, right? Like you have 7 AS. You have. Wait, is that 7 AS as well? Damn, we have to hit our first gable here. But is that, that's not even a kill, is it? Sanj, what if I did like a Steel Lance? Is that somehow better? Is that is that where we are at right now? That's the <laughs> 10 AS. Yeah, that does double. I think that has better odds of killing. Cause we hit uh, we still need to like adapt and not get great shield and everything. I right, just just get the gay bulge crit. Just do the funny fly thing at Altena. I'm done with this shit. Just crit. Fly up. Yeah. Oh oh no. Okay, well, alright. You tried. That's all we can ask of you. Oh, Altaina and V, why? Why? Alright, go Ulster. Finish it. Swap them in the face. Before they get healed by the Fortify squad. Boom! Alright, this enemy face. I'm surprised he even had hit on Ulster. <laughs> I guess because he's not on a mountain? I don't know. Did he... Did he have hit on He me? had seven. Oh. He had seven. Oh, because no weapon triangle disadvantage. That's right. Uh, anyone need some healing over here? I think we're good. I think we're good for the most part. I'll just physic on Kirpriden. And maybe next turn we can get some uh, some kills on the rest of the squad. With people that are not necessarily great at killing everything. Just just join all beer. <laughs> what do you mean? No, he's great. Didn't you see he got like plus three strength earlier? That's true. Which I'm sure gives him better performance on average than Fee. And... Altena <laughs> and Hannibal. It's a big difference maker. Okay, we have these. Let's have our tour run away from some angry wyverns that I think either show up now or after we seize the Frege. Alright, here they come. Going for Ulster over Kirpri. I mean, they're both unhittable monsters. I don't know what I would go for personally. <laughs> Probably the little boy standing not on a mountain. How much hit did you say they have? 7%. No, there's no way. <laughs> That's what it said. There's That's no when he attacked way. that other guy. How is this even real? Thing. Boom. I love how he leaves it with one just to give him like the I illusion know. of safety and then they're dead <laughs> anyway. Alright, how many more? Okay, just a, just a fortify squad. How can you just ignore my boy Kirper like that after I raised him up all the way? That's not, that's not nice. Oh, that's a kill for someone else. Oh, they're going to fortify. You have here. Okay. Oh, they're going to oh, fortify. Yeah, ah, it's okay. Jelvier can still get a kill on a single Baron, I believe. In our man. But I can't believe you guys are doing this right now. Can't believe it. Oh, no. Please tell me I'm not going to die to freaking Fenrir of all things. With my light brand equipped. Is the dark going to beat the light? The dark going to beat the lightness? <laughs> Oh, easy money. Good dodge, good dodge. I don't know why he tried. You can literally see it from a mile away. Alright. Bow squad. What? RNG bugged, I tell you. I think he has like 28 UFELs left, which I thought would be enough, but I count like... How many do we count here? Like I think 10? there were 17 when I counted earlier. 17 bow knights? Including the troubadours? No, the 17 enemies. Oh, okay. Not well, bow knights. Okay, I don't... I really... The troubadours I checked, they don't have a weapon, so I'm not worried about them. Uh, the boss I am worried about, of course. So, if you... So that's, that's about 14 bow knights, then, including the boss, if it's 17 total. I think. It was kind of hard to count, because <laughs> yeah. the screen was moving a lot, but... Yeah, I think this is his third, three, seven, ten, eleven... Okay, this, I think about 14 is about the right thing. 
but let's throw in a couple more abouts just to make sure that everyone knows I'm being approximate here. I'm not literally counting. Because clearly I can't. Alright, Fafal. Just survive the rest, please. Bonk, bonk, bonk. Alright. This is his... I don't think he's level capped yet. I don't think he's close. Okay, they're done, I think. Almost done? Not quite. Pew. Pew. Bonk. Even before you fell breaks and he just, like, dies. I, I, I like how... <laughs> look at those homies. They're just... <laughs> they're just <laughs> where just are like, they going? This forest is not working for me. Oh my god. That's, that's probably their fastest path to Faval, is like through where most of the Nut Forest is. Alright, well, we know f we know Hannibal survives roughly five of these, so if we kill a couple more, he'll be f completely fine. I'll do this one more time. The Wyverns will get there eventually. I don't, I don't think any of them can even reach him right now. Uh, Hannibal or Faval? Yeah, even Hannibal. Even if he get Yeah. Yeah. That's well, so sad. Yeah. Okay, we'll have to get this guy out of here. What's the status? Okay, we still got 14 users left, so we can definitely get... What's his name? Scipio? Scorpius. Uh, we can get him isolated, I think, with, like, maybe one other guy. Yeah, like, that forest over here looking juicy. I think I'll just get him out of here, and then we'll try to beat the rest of Hannibal for funnies. Uh, oh, he has renewal on his bow, right? So that's gonna let him heal a little bit. Alternatively, we can go to Crane of Church. But I think he'll be fine without, because, like, what's the numbers look like against this guy? Uh, are you in a forest by chance? Yes, he is. Okay, that, that changes my mind a little bit about how much. Not I great. Yeah, it's still not <laughs> great. Uh, what's the speed like? We got, we got twenty four. Uh, easy double though. Easy double. Do you have any skills on him? No. Well, I mean, there's always Hannibal for a backup option, right? Let's go here. You fill it up, and then. Hannibal as our backup option. Can we, like, put him in range of just some guys here? Yeah, I don't think he can make it to that forest. He's got some uh, terrain issues. But they'll just, like, congregate around Faval, probably. So how about we just move him closer? We'll go from there. And then here, uh, I gotta keep Seleph moving, because he's gotta seize that castle eventually. Until he gets there, we'll just kind of have to sit and take all these hits. Um, okay, so this is where we... We have to have your test of strength against this new one, right? <laughs> Yo! It won't take forever to get to kill, I promise. Okay. Well, Rin promised, so wait. You're not even yeah, fully yeah. healed? But they healed like three times. Or they healed two times. I guess their, their magic is just kind of nine. <laughs> they have nine magic, that's why. How much is, are we doing right now? With Mr. Joe Helvier. Uh, so, I think he does two-shot, but, you know, Paviz is a thing. So, maybe set it up with Atti and a sleep edge. <laughs> yeah! Down to sleep him! Or bolt, a bolt sword. This is like 15 damage each, so this is not gonna kill him. We'll eat a, a sword in the process, but that's alright. Okay. Alright. Ready for Jehovah to say something dumb here. And we get their money too, why not? We already have already level <laughs> money capped on him anyway. Um, do I help here? Larcy cannot reach anything to kill, so we'll just put her here to help out with the, the good old lover crit. Let's turn on the crab walk. This might be his last crab walk of the series, so. <laughs> no, we'll use him again, right? Uh, right? Right, guys? Right. right, guys? Look at him go! Yeah! There he goes. Yeah, Absolute promise. unit. All right, now before someone here gets killed by a pen, we probably should clean up the remaining enemies. Um, who's the most reliable at killing the boss? I mean, I guess it's Carefree or Shanan. Yeah, Shanan's not really able to reach anything else anyway. He's probably gonna get slept by going here. We have Restore somewhere, I think. Was it you? Yeah, okay, so you can't get slept at any cost. You have 13 res. You're gonna stay out of this zone with like all your might. Do not ever let me put uh, set in range of the enemy sleeps, please. Alright, Shannon. Bonk, bonk. Or Julius, I crave your pardon. Blah, blah, blah. Well, I've heard the same thing two other times. <laughs> I know, right? <That's, laughs> even the first translation of this of this game had that exact line going like, uh, Lord Julius, oh, I'm so sorry for dying the exact same way as everyone else. <laughs> Are you serious? 
Why even give me the, the adept game if you're just gonna do that to me? Oh, you're you're for real. Okay, you're for real. You're actually for real. Get a molster. Oh, let me heal my ulster. Oh, they can rescue someone up here to help out. Uh, who's like good? Ares? <laughs> no, no shade or anything, but who's like good? Well, we have a talk. Oh, all right, they're in love. That's cool. Uh, we'll do that in a second, guys. Before you get picnic, mm -hmm. let me get Ares over here. Ares, do what Kirpre couldn't. Rescue staff has to be one of my favorite parts of this playthrough. Yeah, it's just with the map maps as big as they are, and you have to send units so far away. Yeah. It's so helpful. It's so nice. You could probably rescue Sela through that mountain up here. Oh, you're genius! Yeah, we can move right here. That's gonna save us like 15 minutes of waiting. I love that. Okay, let's let's remember to do that. Uh, let's go over here and do a close range physic on Ulster. I'm just going here because I can't go closer with the sleep staff boys. Here you go, all patched up. We gotta kill this Baron, right? We're gonna try at least. We'll probably not manage and then get slept, but hey. Oh, that's promising. Boom. Oh. The crit sound for this game is just never gets old. Especially when you're having map animations off. Lame. Um, hello? Thank you. Alright, so these people are like all gonna get slapped. Oh, never mind. We have Kanto on our units. I forgot about that. <laughs> <laughs> He's so insane. Ulster, Jesus Christ. My man. Uh, we could warp Nana home, but she has no way to return quickly. So I think we just... I might just have to off-screen promote and bring her back at some point. Alright, recover. Sure, why not? Wifey. Uh, the dance. We'll need that eventually for other reasons. And you're fine? Fee doesn't have the res to not get... Oh, she does. You're 16. You has a 15. You just have a Fenrir. So we can get Fee closer. I don't think we can get Altena closer without her needing restoration every turn. But it's the only way to, like, snipe these guys off the cliffs. Alright. Okay, let's see if Faval's flying. Faval! Come on. <laughs> Oh. They're trying, all right. All right, here he comes. And what are you supposed to be? The name is Faval, son of Bridget. What? As in my dear Aunt Bridget? Well then, the traitor spawn shows his disgusting face at last. <laughs> look who's That's talking. That's so rude. Yeah, right? I mean, Faval really isn't a lot to look at either, though. He's, he's just generic. The other guy's just ugly. He is ugly. I certainly won't object. After all, I get to kill you here and now. Okay. Took the words right of my mouth. Uh, please don't actually kill me. Okay. <laughs> oh, no, not okay. Oh, not okay. Come on, what? Uh, is that a cop? I don't even think he's on here? a forest. Dude, he's not. He's just cheating. Please don't murder me. He's just cheating. <laughs> just cheating. I I don't think I have a horse there. I had something funny on Hannibal, but I think it's the Wing Slayer. Well, good night, Shannon. Guard the castle while we wait, please. Oh what? Oh Fenrir, right? That's that's fine. You can Fenrir Ares. That's that's not gonna hurt at all. Famous last words, I know. Come on, don't be silly. Thank you. Thank you much. Okay, so have all heals. Renewal. A bit. Yep. And I don't know if that takes him out of like kill range, but we can certainly check. We have. Okay, we're doing. Like 40 something damage. So he does die if we just hit him once. The question is, do we hit him? If we don't hit him, what happens? I think we die if we don't hit him. I think we just mm -hmm. check that now, and if it doesn't work, we do something else. <laughs> Get him, Faval. Oh, great. Ah, uh, why? All right, and then Hannibal. Uh, what's your hit rate like? Oh, that's, that's, that's pretty good. That's pretty good. How would you like to be on a forest? That doesn't really change anything. I think you might end up having to kill the troubadours first because they're gonna heal if we don't kill them. The they're gonna heal the knights. Exact two shot. Hannibal was made for this job. Killing yes, go Hannibal. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> One trouble door down. This is his time to shine. <laughs> for sure. 
They'll probably attack uh, Favol anyway, because he has less defense. Probably. Less HP too. Okay, so for Altena to get here, we'll need a dance from all the way from the back. And even then, we are from here with our, what, 6-7 move? 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6, 7. We do reach one guy. And we can put to sleep. I guess that there could be worse things. We'll get Fenrir though, which is a little bit. I think it's not worth... epic. Yeah, it's, it's yeah, it's it's not great, but we'll do it. It's all we can do. Uh, you're gonna start killing sleepy guys with the four seti. Get him out of here! Come on. <laughs> great job. Okay, we can get the guy next to him, too. And then we can get V in here. I wonder if we use the rescue staff to get V up now. You have res, right? Yeah, you can you can go here. Maybe it's better if we did that, but we're already it's already too late, kind of. I think we're just committed <laughs> to this bit. I'll just use the rescue staff defensively. Maybe I'll get Selefo for this turn. Uh, anyone else want to, like, come over and fight things? Maybe... Not said. Anyone here can like kill these things at two range? I guess this, this you can't go wrong with this. Unless he his weapon breaks, we can't go wrong with that. Uh, I guess he's the good distraction for sleep swords. Uh, I guess Tinny's my best two range fighter. I guess we'll roll with her, and then we shall dance. Let's see. What thank we you. Do. Thank you. Thank you. Great dance. Great dance. Okay, we'll go here, and we'll shoot at Fenbeard once, and then we're just totally okay with that. Okay, Volg, that's a one-hit KO. Wonderful. And then you're gonna get this one. I think. Yeah. Looking good. Only two sleeps, one of them will hit Altena. So I guess there's no point in... Waking up Shannon because I just get put to sleep again. Although maybe, mm -hmm. maybe, yeah, we can wake him up. He's not in range anymore. Uh, so said, come on closer and hit that restore button on Shannon. Good morning. Sorry, short nap after all. He just took a power nap before he's gonna take on those Pegasus sisters. Uh, I think Fee's not reaching anything, but if we put her here, then we can fight the Fenrir guy next turn, maybe, or one of the other guys. Uh, let's stop moving Ulster in sleep range then. So just chill here. I guess we can distract the Fenrir with Ares if he decides to go for that. That's totally fine. Our favorite cheerleader, Oifi, is still walking along with everyone else. Thinking he's on the field. I mean, he's here. <laughs> he is here. Oh, the talk. Oh, we already did this one. Let's just get it out of the way again so we don't accidentally trigger it. Yay. We get this one, right? Yep. Great. Okay, I'll just be close to the castle so I can repair or something. Let's just fortify everyone, I guess. While well, everyone is here. Gathered and healthy. Oh, we're supposed to get Selef over here. Well, he's still a turn away from getting there anyway. Yeah. Okay. Alright. Uh, Pavel, up to you. Oh, they're going for Hannibal. Aha! How's it feel? What a foolish mistake. How's it feel, enemies? To get wrecked by Pavis Gaming. Subscribe to Pavis Gaming if you haven't already. Pavis has a soundboard with that on it. A voice clip of me going, subscribe to Pavis Gaming. He just, subscribe, he just matches it every time a general screws him over like this. <laughs> uh, is, is dude okay? I think he's okay. I think I said he survives like five hits. Mm-hmm. And now he's got Dodge Chance, Pavis Chance, all the good stuff. Well, I think the Troopers will probably heal, but I don't think they'll heal them all the way up. Oh, <laughs> imagine not being able to reach the general. God, imagine. Uh, Hannibal might have to pay a visit to church, though. I don't know if he can do this for another round. If only he killed. Yeah, that would have that would have saved a lot of trouble, but then we wouldn't have seen Hannibal do things. Oh, wait, but a cost? What's going on here? Huh? Did I miss see that? Did Hannibal? Oh, he has vantage. That's right. I forgot that Hannibal has vantage. Okay, are you gonna? Are you Yo, gonna... see it now. He won't die. Yeah. Mm, you're right. <laughs> Actually, he won't die. If he killed the Troubadours, he's gonna kill all the other ones first. 
As long mm -hmm. as he can do 48 damage to them. Actually, I think he survives... He probably survives two boat nights. So we won't have to worry about the ones that were healed. Okay, so she gets put to sleep. That's okay. Because no one else will get put to sleep, I think. And then you'll get Fenrir once. That's fine, too. We can just heal that off. I hate dealing with these while I'm also dealing with the next army. So I'm glad to get him. Oh, Altena, you dodged another magical attack. You saved yourself like 100 damage over the course of these two dodges. What a champ. What a Chad, you mean? Can you say Chad about a female? I guess you can. But yeah, why not? All right. True. I mean, I do watch a lot of Chad Chad. So I guess that proves the point. Uh, wait, you're full health? Okay. Can we do 48 to a Bow Knight? In two hits. Two hits is fine. Uh, 39, 24. I think that's exactly 48. He needs to hit all the benchmarks. What a what a chat? <laughs> yeah. I'm learning. Alright, kill the troubadour. What an absolute god. Alright, uh, we'll kill the other one with you fell. I actually don't know if this is a kill. Oh, it is a kill. Okay. <laughs> nice. For a moment I thought I saw not a kill. And then I was uh, I was wrong. Okay, so I don't think Fee can one round the promoted dude, but I think Altena can. So I think we'll restore Altena. Uh, are we guaranteed to kill them all? Yeah, because we have a dance. So yeah, let's just go here. Restore. Get Altena back. And then Altena nukes this guy into the orbit. <laughs> Goodbye, Lock Goodbye. Bishop. And we'll go back here, I guess. As far as we can go. One, two, three. Try this guy on for size. I don't actually think we have a great chance of killing him, but Adept comes through. Yeah. And then we can dance them both. I'm gonna use a rescue staff to get Selif over here. Save him some walking. It's, it's like it's like two turns of walking, but it looks fancy. Come here, Selif. He can seize, I think. Mm -hmm. Yeah, I was thinking the same thing. Uh, well, we have to dance him. But I am. We're gonna dance here because we actually I don't know if we can reach that guy because this is probably a no-fly zone. That he's in. We can check, I guess. No, I think uh, I, I think they were able to reach. Yeah. It feels like it should be no fly zone, because like the, the barricade is right here, but I also think I saw the tiles that they can move on. It looked like it's not a no fly zone. Well, I, guess I only saw one yellow tile. Yeah, all right, let's find out. We could probably at least chuck a javelin at him. Terrible as that would be. Oh, well, worked out. In that case, consider yourself nuked, friend. Excellent. All right, that's great. That's that's wait. So we can just go all the way here. That's broken. <laughs> that's sick. How far can you go? Wow. You just can't get on the road tile. Yeah, I guess <laughs> the road is the road is forbidden. But you can just like go above. That's fine. Okay. Interesting. Didn't know that. Uh, no, everyone else can just kind of vibe. I guess I'll just move to Mount Eagles because they move so slowly. If I don't come here and Aries, next army is gonna move hella quick compared to normal. Like, they have so much move. Uh, okay, Selavus here. These are ready to ambush. Okay, let's see if we can finally get rid of the bow army. I think there's going to be one bow knight that always survives because he has full HP. This guy? Well, not that guy specifically, but one of those guys. But, damn, this is the best enemy face performance I've ever seen from these two uh, <laughs> bow users. <laughs> I'm glad they got their time to shine. Hannibal was set up for this moment. For sure. I mean, he was set up by Faval, but yes. <laughs> the way he just exactly kills them is so satisfying. I know that sounds like nerdy as hell, but... No, simply... not at all. Not at all. I mean, you're probably a nerd too, but yes. Yes, absolutely. Alright. Coolio. Oh. Alright. Oh, yeah, he didn't kill, that's why. Oh, 
Oh, it's so beautiful. I could. <laughs> I've been looking at this for ten hours because it's a V4. Well, so much for Jungbai. I mean, we gotta give the last one to Hannibal too, right? There's no, there's no denying yeah, it. Yeah, of course. We have to. All right, shout out to these two. They'll probably never get to move him again unless I really feel like getting him involved in the final, the final like ride. Maybe I'll move him off screen. Maybe I'll do that. Okay. Uh, well, Selif, just do the honors, I guess. Seize. 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 We're just hours. We finally made it this far. Dun, 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 All right. I think they spawn around here somewhere. I think it should be safe to just see what happens. Let me see what happens. Oh, we've been going like 40 minutes. I think this would probably be a good place to end it off at if we're not doing it all in one swing. Okay. Let's see. Got the Dreadlords coming out. <laughs> And Julia, oh god, the most fearsome enemy of all. Enemy Julia. Okay, oh god, okay, yeah, they're, they're gonna be scary as <laughs> hell. Turn, alright, you guys are moving. They're not moving. <laughs> they might end up in the back of the army after all. They do have leg rings though. All right, and Julia's coming. Oh my god, Pavel, you're such a champ, but I will unequip your your, your youth though, so you don't see that every turn. All right, yeah, I'll leave this till next time. It's been about 40-something <laughs> minutes. We could be better off splitting it up, I think, than trying to go through it all. So, mm -hmm. yeah, it's it's been fun. The Wall of Barons certainly was something. Uh, but oh god, Hannibal is so good. It's so good. I'm gonna miss that guy <laughs> when we're done with this. That was so cool. And uh, next time we'll take on a sage army with some snipers and some uh, some heroes and a uh, massively powerful Ishtar. Three yes. Pegasus sisters with ten move, even though they're flyers. Unheard of in this game. Some uh, some enemy Julia. She doesn't look very scary at all. No worries. Oh, she's got red eyes. What do you mean? Yeah, that's because she has a fire tome. That's why. No, my bad. <laughs> we got some uh, we got some dark mages with sleep. We got Manfroy. We have the twelve dread lords, dead lords to contend with. And of course, the man, the final boss, Julius. the dragon himself, Julius. So, look forward to that. We'll see you all next time. Bye-bye!